Mali obviously a disappointment at the weekend, but it's a, it's a great game to kind of get back into it in the, the league. Such a game. Yeah, massive game. Um, obviously, we went at it last Saturday. It was hurtful. Um, hurt us a lot because of the manner in which we did go out. And um, yeah, we want to put it right Saturday. So all eyes and focus towards that because it's a massive game. Yeah, your league form, your home form's been so good as well. You just want to put that behind you well, on the weekend and just you know, concentrate on the league now. Yeah, it's all we can do, isn't it? Um, we were disappointed and hurt in the last few days, but you know it's about how we react. And uh, we've got a big, um, big game ahead Saturday to put it right. And we, you know, we owe it to the supporters and to ourselves um, and to the staff a better performance and um, a winning performance. So yeah, we've got to yeah react and react well. There's a lot of fans up there. It was you know, obviously your role from Aberdeen your days. There's not many teams bring that amount of support. Well, does that make it? Does that make it more helpful that you maybe feel that you can roll them one as well? Yeah, I, yeah. I just think the goals were soft. We conceded, and when you know goals changed games, and then gave them the momentum, and it was just not like us. So it was a bit uncharacteristic performance. But you know, there's no point crying about it, feeling sorry for ourselves. Just gotta react and you know put a good performance in. Yeah, especially for the ones that made. The journey the other day, um, we didn't deliver for them, so uh, we need to put a big performance in on Saturday. Do you start to, at this stage of the season, nine games left, do you start to think about you know, Europe homing in on that one as well? It's a game that can put you forth. And... Yeah, just take it game by game and um, try and win as many as possible. And obviously, we've done well to this point and put ourselves in a good position and we don't want to, you know, this is the business end of the season and we don't want to let it go to waste and, you know, ruin everything we've worked hard for. So we're determined to stay high and stay here yeah, and finish as well as possible. How much have you enjoyed the season here so far? Yeah, it's been brilliant. Uh, great lads, great staff, obviously the gaffer. Um, worked with him before, just great to work with and, yeah, we enjoyed it a lot. All sort of people in the area. Just great people, great humble down to earth people, so it's a pleasure to be part of. And obviously the, the club signed a few attacking players in, in January as well. Would you stay down there, kept the place the team? Is it is that competition been good for you as well? Knowing that there's players on the bench. Yeah, definitely. Um two quality players that came in and I'm sure we'll see um big moments from them from now till the end of the season. So um I think Kev was struggling um with a little injury, but I think, yeah, when he comes in, we all know he's got goals in him and stuff like that, so, and obviously Greg's quality is brilliant, so, yeah, two great additions, and, yeah, so I think they've got a huge part to play as well. Is that even going to raise the standards in training? You have to be able to it every day in training as well? Yeah, they don't accept anything less, the staff and manager, so um, we always have to be on it, and... Yeah, that's why Saturday was so confusing, really, because we just weren't ourselves. We went, I don't know what happened, but it's confusing, but I just got to move on and correct it on Saturday. How about crowd expected on Saturday, Marley? How big a factor is that going to be for, for such a big match? Yeah, great. Um, bigger the better. We, we yeah, prefer it when it's you know high-pressured games, and um, yeah, we want to deliver for the fans, and obviously they deserve a big performance after last Saturday.